Hi, my name is Clarence Moriwaki. My presentation is entitled Nidoto Nayoni, or Let It Not Happen Again. And I tell it in four H's, history, honor, healing, and hope. History is my first segment of my PowerPoint presentation and the largest. The PowerPoint, by the way, includes more than 150 slides. More than 120 of them are photographs, historical images, propaganda posters, and many other media that fully tell out this story. The history segment starts rightfully with the Suquamish people, the indigenous people of central Puget Sound, then the European settlers, including Captain Vancouver, coming to Bainbridge Island, and then the Japanese coming in the late 19th century. They tell their story about their immigration, like all other immigrants, wanting to have a better life, becoming integrated in this tight-knit community on this island of Bainbridge, and then World War II starts. And after December 7, 1941, the Bang Bainbridge Islands became the first of more than 120,000 Japanese Americans to be forcibly removed from the West Coast. In this segment, I talk about the Constitution issues behind that, some of the political and racial things that were going on that led to that unconstitutional action, and then I make comparisons of 1942 to 2001. I compare the propaganda and images used to stereotype and create hatred against Japanese to what happened to Muslims post 9-11. For many people, they find this the most evocative and most memorable and moving part of my presentation. And then I move on to honor. And on Bainbridge Island, they were unique in that the entire community pretty much supported their friends and neighbors, which was not the case up and down the West Coast. There were many people who did support their Japanese American friends and neighbors, but they were the exception in their communities. Bainbridge Island, almost as a whole, cared for their friends and neighbors, led by the Woodwards, who were the newspaper editors, editorializing against this unconstitutional action, having people write back from the camps, helping create an atmosphere through editorial leadership of what is right and what should be done in America. So it's a very powerful, timely story as well. Then I get into healing. And healing is what happened when we created the memorial site on Bainbridge Island. I go a little bit into the history of how we created it, and then I give people a personal guided tour, a virtual tour, if you will, of the memorial site, hopefully encouraging people to come and visit and learn more about the story. The final H is hope, and I leave people with a lasting message. I started with the title, Ninoto Nayoni, Let It Not Happen Again. That's my final slide, but I also say to them that Nidoto Nayoni is a call to action. You must act. And the slide that I point up, no tonayoni, let not happen again, I always say, the opposite of love is not hate. The opposite of love is fear. You cannot have manufactured fear drive policy, drive hatred against your neighbor, drive hatred against your fellow citizen. This is what I want people to be taken away with my presentation. It's been very informative for a lot of people. Many people have liked it, and I hope you do too. I would love to be a featured speaker with the Humanities of Washington. Thank you for considering me.